It's getting me really wet. It's Peter Ilfield. All right, big game today with the charity match, and again, it's Jacksonville, pretty much an arch nemesis of the Philadelphia fight. Expectations for today, Pete? A tough encounter. Jacksonville always are. They're a great team, um, and so are we. So uh, you know, we got uh, we got our skipper who's had to go home under unforeseen circumstances. But I think you know we've we've had adversity before, and we've we've risen over it, and I think we will again today. Um, these guys are a tough side, and they're ready for us. Better bit of preparation than we have. So, obviously, with Jacksonville travelling and you know the stigma between them being such a great side and one of the founding members, obviously along with Philadelphia, is there more emphasis on this game because of the chat and because of the rivalry, or is this just another day at the office? It's another day at the office. No. Uh, it doesn't matter how you're playing. You, you, you've got to put your best out foot forward and uh, your best strategy out there. Uh, you've just got to think a little bit more about these guys because. They're, they've got a, a, a good team all the way across the paddock. You know, they've got 13 good players. They've got another you know, five or six guys sitting on the sideline who can play there as well. So it's all relative. Uh, you've, you've, you've certainly got to lift your, uh, your application for today. All right, Pete, thanks. Good luck for today. We're ready for the fifth annual ALS charity match between the Valley Forge Casino and Resort Philadelphia fight and the Firehouse Jackson Probably how subs that would be, Jacksonville Axman. Yeah. It's the fifth year of doing this, and this is always a huge encounter. So stand back, ready for some fireworks. We've got the lovely Vixens on hand today. A good crowd here come to watch the game, and we're all set to get underway and ready to roll. It's, uh, it's a lot cooler now than it was earlier. We've got a lot of short wheel bases on the field, ready to roll. It's going to be a good time, so hang on to your hats, folks. Going to be fast and furious, and I'm not talking about driving cars. Good kick off there by the fight. Good chase out of a dummy half. Boys are getting up and getting the tackles in. Nice tackle by their way. James Coleman. Try and get a better view of what's going on here. The ball's been better than the big fellas coming up. Ball's been offloaded. So we get into a nice tackle. Boys are trying to get into this stride a little bit. Heading towards the fifth tackle. Go, Matty! Fred Shorten with the bomb. Well fielded, but well recovered there by the Philadelphia fight as we get into their first attacking. Ooh. Getting out from their own goal line is going to be tough against a very good Jacksonville Axman's team. Very committed to the tackle. Our boys are doing well so far, getting up off the ground. It's early, folks. Ball's being spun. Here comes a kick from Chase Mason. That's a beautiful Michael kick down. Go, 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 go. Send it back. Oh, and there we go. Go. Great chase. Great chase by the Philadelphia, the Valley Forge Casino Resort Philadelphia fight. National champions defending their title on their home ground at the YSU Sports Complex here in uh, Wayne, Pennsylvania. The shenanigans. You gotta love a little bit of show. Hey, and there he goes down. Let's go on! Let's go on! Let's go on! Being straight at the tackle. All right, good kick. Thank you. Go, Matty! So again, Philadelphia fight. Back on defense, goal line defense, and penalty is set of six for the Axemen as they're attacking. Coming straight at them. So far, the defense is holding up really well. Big Shannon Higgity coming in. He's getting looked after very well by the great defense and run that the Philadelphia fighters got. They're coming across now. 
Great work coming out of line there was Jared Frymore picking up the uh, extra man that was over in coverage there. Fourth tackle coming up. Boys are holding defensively very well. No! And looks like six more tackles to Jacksonville. It's a tough defensive set here for the Philadelphia fight. Try being scored by Axman first. Four points to nothing. Oh, actually, let's take that back. According to the referee, he's saying the ball was held up, so it's going to be a scrum with a head feed. To Philadelphia fight. It's a great defensive effort on their line like that. Well done. First score looked like it was possible. Big Matty Thornton. Could have been in there, a little bit of a blood bin. It's just a mere flesh wound. Carry on, sir. Couple of the X-Men guys that are a little bit hurt. Somebody with a wrist and he's a bit of a blood bin with an eye there for, for the, what was potentially the try score. Matt Thornton. <laughs> short side as they bring the ball back over to the open. Yeah, and that's Larry Manor. Oh, he got tripped up at the at the last second there. It's great, great set this by the It's a good tackle by Jared Fiber on a good chase from the kick from Chase Mason as the fight come up in a good defensive line. Charity match are back on attack. Attacking the short side. Starting to tell some early mistakes from both sides. Berkey comes up with a good run, taking on the defensive line very well, moving the ball on the last tackle. And a great kick again by Chase Mason. Great kick. And, and a lost forward, so now the emphasis goes back on the Philadelphia fight on attack with uh, probably about six yards from the try line. A forced error from a great kick from Chase Mason. Chase is really going to have to start coming into his own, take control of this game, as he already has with some of the kicks that he's made, to lead the boys around the park to bring this one home. on 
on that. Uh, played from the base of the scrum, boys got a little bit sideways, but off again, settled down. Marcus Respers has the ball in his hands, if anything is possible. The boys set up on the third tackle. Come on, come on! Kelly, oh! And unfortunately, Philadelphia loses the ball forward while hot on attack, going to shoot, come, using a cut out ball wide, ball lost forward. So it gives Jacksonville a feed in the scrum. Let's go, X Men! effort here by the Philadelphia fighters. They already got Jacksonville kicking early. Putting it into the end zone with Jared Frymore with the ball, trying to bring it out. Good chase by the Jacksonville Axemen to get up there and corral the speeds from the Philadelphia fight. tackle on Dave Wilmore as he tried to dart out a dummy half there. So the ball being given back with a penalty advantage to the Philadelphia fight. It's a chase. Absolutely nails that in touch. What a great kick from Chase Mason. Really putting the emphasis on the fight to get back into a solid attacking position here early in the first quarter. Uh, today's game obviously an ALS charity match um, for the greater Philadelphia area. It's the fifth annual. The boys are uh, really looking forward to, to bringing this one home. Good stuff, boys. Good stuff. Keep moving, keep moving. Oh, nice. losing a little bit of their structure right now but they're still hot on to attack ball coming out wide short ball given to Mike Kelly he's getting hit a little bit there a couple of them on the tackle great kick and great kick go Mike Kelly oh, oh so close thank you for football here in uh, Pennsylvania. A little warm earlier today, obviously. Go, 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 Yeah! Yeah! It looks like Jacksonville will score yeah. under the post for the first try of the game, putting Jacksonville up to 4 nothing with a kick still to come. Uh, great run by Brent Shorten as he broke the defense. A lot of hard work being done by the uh, Valley Forge Casino and Resort Philadelphia fight. 
I know what you said. Ah! Yes, we will. Sure. No, not yet. I'm only joking. I won't score you. Great crowd on here today. Who taught you over and out? Philadelphia Flight, Jackson Blacksman, Charity Shield Match. Well, it's a charity company, so we're going on with the show, so, but it's a great, great cause. Come on. ALS charity, Lou Gehrig's disease, you know, it's a, as everybody knows, such a debilitating disease and we're very proud to be a part of it. Uh, looking forward to the after match functions at the Valley Forge Casino. Um, food and drinks and everything afterwards. The boys are enjoying the Vixens being here today. They look wonderful as always, getting ready to dance at the quarter times, half times for the entertainment of the people here. And like I said, a, a good crowd to witness the spectacle of this great ALS charity match between the Valley Forge Casino and Resort Philadelphia Fight and the Jacksonville Blacks. And with that kick, it takes the score out to Jacksonville 6, the Philadelphia Fight 0. Still a lot of time to be played in this game, folks. Still a lot of time. The boys won't give up. That's one thing for sure. They'll get out there and they'll put their heads up and they'll rip into it. And they I got to take my boot or something. Rip. Can't move it well. It's early, I know, and 6-0 has been a bit of an arm wrestle so far. Both sides showing a willingness to attack from anywhere. And after that, what, what happened there, folks, was uh, he didn't play the ball, he didn't pick the ball up completely and play the ball between his legs, so therefore it's been deemed an illegal go, play the ball, therefore a penalty to go, Philadelphia fight. And they're hot on the attack already. Clayton Fuller smashing it up the middle. Go Getting set now, guys. Chomping at the bit to get their hands on it. Goes over to Rich Henson. Come on, Marcus. Marcus Respus, he's a handful to deal with this man. Playing out in the right center position there. We're in number four. Henson again out to James Coleman. Taking up the big hit right up the middle. Driving into the, towards the goal line. Giving the fight a great opportunity here. Trying to sneak out a dummy half, but he didn't catch the Jacksonville defense. Come on, come on, come on. Sleeping on that one. Ball, 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 ball. And unfortunately, a bad play the ball pass from the play the ball area puts the fight, all that good opportunity gone, and it puts Jacksonville hot on attack again. All right, James Coleman being penalized there for holding down the tackle. Once the tackle's been made, and you've got to make an effort to get off once a referee's called. That's what the is. And there goes the ball. <laughs> Good thing we have extra balls. Holding him up so he couldn't score. She's right. At the 
And again, holding him, holding him. They're holding him up. Held up again in the tackle. Brown looking for the quick play of the ball. He tried to sneak in. And did he sneak in? What does the referee say? And that's another try to the Jacksonville Axemen. After all that good sustained pressure by the by the Jacksonville Axemen, they paid off and they snuck underneath on the right hand side there of the play of the ball area. But a great effort by the fight to hold them out. Relentless pressure. Taking the score out now to 10 points to favor of the firehouse ups. Jacksonville and zero to the Valley Forge Casino Don't worry folks, if our boys will hang in there, we'll be, they're going to play this all the way there. You've never seen a team with more heart than this uh, Philadelphia fight. Every week they seem to be <laughs> undersized playing against some big boys here from Jacksonville. But it, the Philadelphia hey, fight definitely have lots of heart. <laughs> Looking for another pinpoint accurate kick from Chase Mason. With a good chase to follow up. Try and keep hold of that. That thing is that's got snow on it, it's so high. And a great chase by Marcus Respus to keep them in their own time. And that would be quarter time. Now, the reason why we do quarter time here, folks, is for the simple fact that heat and air during the summer is phenomenal. So we, we do it for the safety of the players. Um, it's 4.20-minute quarters. I know everybody's like, well, why four? You know, why not two 40-minute halves like the rest of the world? Well, I get to, it's really hot here. Um, and these guys, while in really good physical condition, it's more for the safety of the players than anything else. I see you chilling by the bar. Why don't you grab your girls and come chill with a star? He up in VIP and drinks on me. Swag on tight with a gangsta lead. Everybody knows just who I are. Yeah, watch your back, swing your head. Just like that. I don't care. I'm about to take you home. 